Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel where I'm going to be talking about America's Next Top Model again and it hasn't even started. So if you go to the H1's website and you go to the ANTM page you can actually see and watch the first five minutes of the premiere episode which got me really excited so I watched it and I'm going to talk about it. I'm going to talk about what happened and where we're gonna go from here because I'm it, oh my god it was so good it's really really good so I put a link down below for the first five minutes if you want to go watch that before you watch this video pause this video click on the link and go watch it right now and then come back and we can talk about it because I want to talk about it with somebody yeah so go click it now and I'll wait for you to come back First things first, they introduce some of the contestants that we haven't seen in the super trailer. They introduced Marissa, who's from H-Town, who I actually have met and talked to before multiple times. They introduced Justine, who is Filipina, um, which I'm super excited about. She just graduated high school, which is so cute. They introduce um, Cherish, who I am super obsessed with. She has red hair and she has a fiery personality and she said sticks and stones may break my bones but bitch you'll never phase me or bitch you don't phase me I'm excited that it just makes me think that she's gonna be one of the really intense characters but also super focused on what she's doing so I'm excited for her um, they introduced Benta who's from Gambia um, they introduced Gia, who is from Bryan College Station, which is actually where I went to college and I lived there for five years. Um, I've never met her, but knowing that she's from Texas and from kind of my second hometown is really awesome because she has that thick southern accent and she's super cute and beautiful and I really think she has potential to go all the way. I'm hoping because she's one of my faves. The next thing that happens in the first five minutes is the models go into this room, then they meet Tyra Banks, which I was really surprised that Tyra Banks was actually going to be in the episodes, um, just because she's not involved with the show as much as she was as the host. She's passing the torch along to Rita Ora, but the way that they transition from season to season um, from 22 to 23 with Tyra passing the torch onto the new panel of judges was incredible. She talks about being a boss, talking about um, having your own brand, but also saying that so she can give more opportunities to young girls and models and people anywhere in the world, she's going to not be the host and she's going to let someone else take over. It was a really cool transition and made me appreciate that Tyra's not the host anymore. Um, and that there's somebody new, somebody fresh, somebody who's going to give the show a new insight and a new point of view. So they did a really good job with showing Tyra and then letting her leave the show with grace and poise and beauty and then passing on the torch. So I thought that was really cool. But the one thing that was so funny when they were meeting Tyra was when Paige, she made this face and she was just like, I couldn't tell if she was like excited or if she was just like starstruck or if she was just like making a face that she was over it, but I thought it was really funny. The they introduced two more people later on in the first five minutes, which are Chris Lian and Tatiana. Tatiana is an entrepreneur, she has her own business, which is awesome. And then they we we meet Chris Lian, who is just a super fan and she's really beautiful. I kind of didn't think a lot about her when I did my Meet the Cast interview, but now seeing her and hearing her speak, I really like her a lot. I don't know how she'll do in the competition. I hope she does really well, but we shall see. The last thing they do in the first five minutes is they go and they start doing their comp cards with Massimo. If you didn't know the photographer, Massimo has been doing a lot of the photographs for Top Model for years. Um, if you watch any season, you'll see him in the background. Um, he's really awesome, and so they go and they do some photos for their comp cards to get to the new panel of judges and that's kind of where the first five minute ends. So it kind of leaves a really nice cliffhanger for what's to come. The models haven't met the new judges, they haven't met Rita Ora, they don't really know what's going to be happening so 
it set up the stage for saying this is what Top Model was, this is where you are, and this is where we're going, um, which was really awesome to see before the actual episode starts because I know a lot of people that comment on these videos that I do about Top Model in the new season are like, Tyra, I wish she was not going away, I wish she was still involved with the show, but even though she's not going to be on the show, it's still going to be amazing. It's still the show that we all love, and it's going to be new and exciting and fresh and y'all. Yeah. But that's it for the first five minutes. I sped through that really fast. I'm going to be super involved with this season. I'm going to be doing recaps. I'm going to be doing all other kinds of cool stuff that I'll tell you about later. But one thing that I can share with you is that there's going to be an ANTM Snapchat filter on Monday for the premiere. Um, I've seen it, and it's really incredible so make sure on Monday you snapchat with the filter you can send me the snapchat you can do whatever you want with it you can tweet it at me whatever but you should definitely go and use the top model snapchat filter um, because it's really cool it looks like nothing that snapchat has ever done before which I'm excited about but if you want to see me react to the cast introductions you can go watch that video down below if you want to see me talk about the super trailer you can see that video down below and make sure you tune back and subscribe to my channel because I will be doing recaps of all of the episodes and some really other fun and exciting things for this cycle of America's Next Top Model. I hope you're excited. It's gonna be really good. I have high hopes for it. In less than like four days, we're gonna see the very first episode of Cycle 23 with brand new models, brand new judges on a new network. It's gonna be awesome. But thank you so much for watching this video. I will see you next time after who knows what they're going to release i've been doing everything that they release a video about so if they release something else before monday you'll probably see me before the premiere but if not i'll see you for my recap of the premiere episode of cycle 23.